everyone. So this is hot out of the mailbox, or rather, I didn't get it out of the mailbox. The um, mail person actually handed it to me. So right now it is 7.32. So our mail was running late today, unfortunately, because our carrier had to, um, she told me that she had to pick up somebody else's route, which sucks for her, because then that means that she's probably working more than 12 hours today. Um, so right here I have my Hobonichi haul from Little Craft Place. So Friday I had seen literally about maybe 30 minutes after um, they had posted on Facebook that they got their shipment in for Hobonichi, um, I went ahead and ordered. Good thing she had already put everything up um, on the website so that you could go ahead and order while she was sorting everything out. And I knew I had to order right away because that stuff was gonna go fast. Because she's, I think, the first US retailer that I saw that was actually selling the stuff. So this is um, Hobonichi 2022. Um, now, I actually had my heart set on ordering a cover um, and you know, I was looking at how much it was going to cost if I ordered it straight from the Hobonichi website, but you know, I just could not, I just couldn't get myself to order it because of the shipping because they use FedEx. Now, granted, I live in Memphis, so I mean, that stuff would probably have come straight to Memphis and then I would have gotten it even faster, but it's not so much that it, because it's FedEx, I mean, it is because it's FedEx, but the fact that it costs way more than ordering if they were using just regular Japan Post. And I just couldn't justify, like, I think it would have came out to like 40 something maybe um, on, you know, on shipping. I don't know, I used to like order way back in the day, I used to order a lot of like doll stuff from Japan and Asia and, they would ship it EMS and I just had no problem for some reason paying that, I guess because I knew that I couldn't get it in the US. So when I would order, I would make sure that I would order to kind of justify the shipping cost. Well, not anymore these days. So um, I decided to just wait until somebody got, you know, their stock in. And fortunately, Little Craft Place got theirs first. So, I went ahead and went on the website and for like about five minutes I was trying to decide what I was going to get and um, just spur of the moment changed my mind and got something completely different than what I had intended. So let's go ahead and open this. There we go. I didn't expect it to come in a box but that's nice. Unfortunately, it's not the pink Hobonichi box, but that's okay. Oh, and um, I was gonna order, like I said, on the Hobonichi website because I really wanted to get that mint green pen, but yeah, you wanna spend that much shipping just so you can get a pen. <laughs> so I don't think it's included on here. Oh, wow, I do get a pen, but just not the uh, Hobonichi pen. I love how she packed everything. Now, I've ordered from Little Craft Place before. The first thing I'd ever ordered from her was actually the surprise box, which um, I will try to link her video at the um, top right, um, which was a very big surprise because she got a lot of stuff and it was a, yeah, I might order in the future again from her um, because it's a great way to get a whole bunch of, you know, of stuff and it's not even that bad of a price. Um, I'm thinking I might order for my nieces um, one of her other surprise boxes. She's got a donut one and she has a, I think a mermaid one. And then there's a Christmas box too. So I don't know, we'll see. Okay, so really nice pin here with the, um, with the heart, as you can see. And it says Lady Boss on it. Huh, cute. Okay, so then I have a card here, business card her wall of washi. One day I hope to be able to visit this place. I think she's near Houston, is she? I'm not sure, Spring, Texas. I have cousins that live in Houston and I need to visit them. Okay, so here's what I end up getting. Ah, the Animal Crossing um, cover. I was gonna get the um, Shell E.T., I think that's what it's called, the Paris one and um, you know, I kept looking at that, then I kept looking at this. Now, I don't have a Nintendo Switch, 
I've never played <laughs> Animal Crossing, but I just couldn't resist because I really love the mint and the blue. Okay, and it's a really cute cover and everybody has been trying to get it. It's like sold out, I think on the website, on the Hobonichi website, and it's uh, just really popular. And I just, this time, you know, I wanted something more kawaii, um, kawaii than uh, the um, Paris one. I might go ahead and order the, um, the tea cover. I might have to like order it from a different website and then um, sell the um, Hobonichi that it came with. Now I didn't really intend on getting um, the planner because I was going to get the day free one. And so I'm going to, um, I don't know, I'm going to see if I want to get, still go with the day free because I have the, um, the 2021 cover. I'm not cover, I'm sorry, the Hobonichi in A5 also, but you know, I tried my best to like write at least once a week, but it just kind of fizzled out after I'd say May. So I figured the day free would actually work better. So we'll see. This came with the, ja um, the Japan, the Japanese version, of, you know, the cousin. So the one that I have, I think is the English uh, version. So I'm, ex I'm really curious to see how it looks now. Let me go ahead and pull these out. So I did get two cover on cover, or COC. Um, I got the clear one, and then I also got this one. I forgot what this one is called. The name is not on there. But this one is definitely sold out on the um, Hobonichi website. And um, this one I'm going to put on the cover that I got last year, which is that turquoise one so that at least I have some kind of a design on it, you know, because right now I only have the, it's just the clear cover. This cover is obviously for that one, okay? So we're gonna put these aside. And then also got, I thought I got more than that. Huh, I'll have to look at my order. So I got two pencil boards. I got the Animal Crossing one, the matching one, okay? And I also got the um, regular one. Now, if you guys don't know what a pencil board is, um, a pencil board is what you use when you're writing. You stick it underneath the page so that one, the, um, the paper underneath is not going to get imprinted. And two, also, if there's some ghosting, excuse me, if there's some ghosting, um, it doesn't transfer onto the other page. I always like using like a pencil board. I, mean, I make my own, like in fact at work, I have a laminated sheet that um, I use. So like when I'm doing an intake, I just um, put that laminated sheet underneath. So that way when I'm writing, it's a smoother um, surface, you know, and it's not pressing onto the next page. So um, yeah, these are pretty good quality, I think. I mean, actually, this feels flimsier than this one, but that's okay. So, hold on here. I just gotta look, because I could have sworn that there was supposed to be something else that I ordered. So let's look at my order here. No, this is right. I must have taken something out. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and look at the cover. So it came with stickers, which is a cute bonus. So this is what the cover looks like. And then there we go. And here are the page markers. Cute. Okay. And then here is the actual Hobonichi. Now, why did I choose the cousin, the A5? Because the A6 is too small for me. Um, when I do write, I tend to write a lot. <laughs> And I like to memory journal, so I will put pictures, and sometimes I like to put more than one picture. Um, I just find that the A6, it's just too small for me right now. I have actually an A6. Um, I've shown it before. Hold on, let me take this out. So, here's the, like I said, it is the Japanese version. Okay. Yeah, I think. I think I might go ahead and, and sell it. Um, I just got to see more people posting um, their day freeze. 
because I can get it cheaper and um, I might sell this. I just need to see what the base price is and then add um, priority mail shipping and then that's it because I'm not going to jack up the price. I mean, I see some people selling the Hobonichis for like a ridiculous amount, which, come on, really? I'm not looking at making a profit off of this. Um, it's one thing if you're selling a cover that hasn't been, that's been retired and is hard to find, but it's another thing when you're selling something like this. So, yeah, let me, for those who have, don't know, um, this is an A6. So I'm going to put it here as a comparison. That's an A6. So this is from, what year was this from? Usually it says, huh, I want to say this was 2018 or 2019. So there's a picture of my dog, who sadly, he's already passed away. Um, but yeah, you can see the difference in size, see? And um, this is not a Hobonichi in it. It's actually an MD, a Midori notebook that's in there that I ordered a long time ago. I just have not used it yet. But um, yeah, this is like, really? That's a little too much. I tend to write, like I said, a lot when I do write. So yeah, that is my little craft haul. So I'm excited. Um, as like all people that use Hobonichi, it's like this is the time of the year we order it and then we have to wait until the beginning of the year to use it. So it's just gonna sit in the box until January 1st. So yeah, there we go. My haul from a little craft place. If um, I believe she still has some of these in stock. Um, she did post, she had a few left, she said, and this was like a couple of hours ago. I saw her post on Instagram, I think. So if you're looking to get some Hobonichi um, planners and covers, head over to Little Craft Place, okay? All right, I'll see you guys later on in the week. Bye.